Warning, you may not learn any Finnish in this video. I'm just explaining things about the Finnish language. Thanks. Finnish is such a weird language. What I mean is uh, some things are really simple and easy. Some things are really hard. Let me show what I mean. For example, pronunciation is really easy. Like when we have these languages like Chinese, the same word pronounced differently can have a whole new meaning. Or in English, when words are said like the, Finnish doesn't have an accent. And that's the accent for you. Jerry, towards the end of the race, Jerry, towards the end of the race, you were starting to lose some time there. What was going on? Uh, last five laps, I take it easy. Uh, I make so. Okay, that Finnish doesn't have an accent. That's a bit overstated, but a, a little bit. But still, let's just compare the ABCs so you can see. Okay, I didn't actually find the original one, so I'm just gonna say them for you. English. It's like this A B C D E F G Finish A B C D E F G You can hear the difference The Finnish one sounds really mundane and bland and um, really boring actually And that's how you pronounce Finnish The O, A and Ö they're the most hard to outsiders, but actually they're really easy. First of all, the Swedish O. You can just forget it. We really don't use it at all. It's only here to appeal to the Swedish, I guess. Okay, I just check this. There's not a single word in Finnish that used the Swedish O. And it's just pronounced O. There's nothing to it. Don't worry. Now the A. Do you know the West Coast gangsters say that? Man. That's the... Man, yeah, okay, that's that's horrible. I'm sorry. Now the er, uh, you know, in the British accent, you say the, like the the. Yeah, that's er, uh, basically. See, that's not hard. You have many these kinds of letters too, but you don't just write them that way. So what's so hard about Finnish then? There's not that much words in Finnish compared to English, at least. Well, uh, I got one word for you, and one word only. Conjugation. Like for example, the word kauppa or shop has over 2000 different types for many different scenarios. And all of these are perfectly understandable by Finns. There's this joke going around, I'll put it to the screen, there's too much reading, but um, it's basically that you can just conjugate and conjugate over and over again. A simple word. That is a dog, or in this case, koira. A quick intermission. After this video, you have no excuses to say sauna wrong. Sauna. It's not that hard. No, it's not sauna. It's sauna. Okay, back to the topic. Okay, I actually lied there before. There is really more to it than conjugating. Here's a few of the reasons. The first reason is um, Finnish is nothing like any other language out there. Except Estonia, but hey, it's Estonia we're talking about here. They even stole our national anthem. JK, I have nothing against Estonians. <laughs> but did you notice how same it sounded like? The languages, I mean. And notice how they don't resemble anything else. Oh, actually, people say Finnish sounds like Japanese for some reason. And I just don't get it. Okay, so the Finnish doesn't resemble any European language out there. I'd say it like that.
Now I'm gonna show you some 2012 irrelevant Finnish memes, but they um they belong to this topic, so um they're relevant now. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> now the other thing that's hard in Finland, or actually the third hardest, Finnish has really questionable grammar. Even I, I have lived the, my full life in Finland, and I still kind of struggle with it in school. And that, if anything, tells something. Okay, I'll admit, the Finnish we are studying is a bit more advanced than some starter level Finnish. But simple sentences like, I like you, would be directly translated to Minä tykätä sinä. Now while I'm listening to that recording, that actually sounds like Japanese. I'm not gonna lie. But that was actually bad Finnish. It would be correctly Mira tykkään sinusta. Notice how the sentence feels more full and you don't sound like a complete caveman. There's much more to the Finnish language, but I don't think I should talk anymore. If you want to, I can talk about Finnish language or even teach you some in later videos. But I think this is enough for today. Oh hey, if you enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, the basic YouTube stuff. But hey, at least I told you something about Finland. See you next time.